much of the big data for development research is coming from northern institutions. Uh, this dynamic has meant that the issues deemed significant to the debate tend to be driven by northern concerns rather than led by software voices and global south collaboration. Uh, IDRC is pleased to support the establishment of this Big Data for Development Network as a software-led network with the objective of developing policy-relevant research on Big Data for Development. We are very happy to be part of this network on Big Data for Development in the Global South, which is possible through a generous support of the International Development Research Centre of Canada. This network is important principally because it allows for Southern voices to engage in the global discourse around big data in developmental policy. And more importantly, uh, it allows for South-South linkages and learnings because our context in the, in the Southern countries are not always the same as in the global North. In order to bring big data to bear on African development agenda, the African hub of the network will capitalize and align the focus of its work on the African Development Bank High Five. Light and power Africa, feed Africa, industrialize Africa, integrate Africa, and improve the quality of life of the people of Africa. We also note that human capital and infrastructure for data is a challenge that needs to be addressed. The hub's objective will be to increase the number of big data scientists on the continent through training and partnership, to capitalize research on big data in Africa, to address policy, infrastructure, funding, and human capital gaps, to provide a platform for practitioners to network, learn, and coordinate activities. To build continuous capacity for big data in Africa, we need to expose our young people, those with the interest and the skills in data science, and big data in particular, to, uh, the, to the industry. So that they, uh, they connect with the private sector, they connect with government, and understand exactly what the industry needs. We believe that as long as we have a continuous capacity being built from the pathway from academia into industry, we'll have the, the people, we'll have the data, we'll have the technology uh, to, to deliver better development outcomes for all. Hello, this is Freddy from CEPE. Uh, we are very happy to be part of this big data network. CEPE will be running the hub in the LATAM countries and we will be approaching different scenarios. One of them is the data analysis and the data analysis will look into the possibility to take data from private sector and other institutions uh, from different sectors to include the approach of the SDGs and how the SDGs can also be measured with non-traditional data sources. But also we will build a community of practice uh, to be able to share experiences and best practices on how the big data can uh, contribute uh, for the SDGs agenda as well.